All right, guys, let's start up uh, our day two of the vlog series. Um, guys, with this day two, we're actually going to start up phase two of this whole vlog series where we're going to be actually looking into the specifics of uh, the differences between some of the DIN and the ISO standards. Uh, now, today, I'd like to start this one with a moment of silence for, you know, DIN 933 and DIN 931. Just kidding. No, uh, the, the reason I say that is because they were actually supposed to have been re withdrawn as far back as 1987. And then in 1987, there were policies passed by whatever governing body is doing this. And they, uh, they actually wanted them to be fully withdrawn off the shelf by 1992. And yet 27 years later, here in 2019, DIN 933 and DIN 931 is still going strong and causing confusion with a lot of people today, right? Because if you haven't heard, um, there is an ISO equivalent for those. And so, so we're going to talk about some of those differences real quick. Um, I'm going to make it real easy for you, okay? Just repeat after me. 10, 12, 14, 22. Again, 10, 12, 14, 22. You're probably wondering, like, why is this guy saying 10, 12, 14, 22? Because those are the only sizes that DIN 933 and its equivalent, ISO 4017, and then DIN 931 and its ISO equivalent, ISO 40, uh, 14, are different. At all the other sizes, they Exact, pretty much exactly the same, right? For 99.9% .9 of the applications, okay? And, but at those sizes, 10, 12, 14, and 22, there is a difference in the width across the flats. That at the 10, 12, and 14 size, the width across, across the flats is actually uh, slightly smaller. It's about one millimeter smaller. Whereas at the M22 size, the width across the flats is actually about two millimeters larger. Okay. And that's really the only difference. Okay. Remember that, you know, a DIN 933, we're talking about a hex head cap screw, right? Um, with the DIN 931, we're talking about the uh, hex head cap screw, but it's partial thread, whereas the 933 is full thread. And so that's the same thing with those ISOs. That DIN 933, equates to ISO 4017. So both of those are going to be full thread hex head cap screws, okay? Whereas the DIN 931 equates to the ISO 4014. So both of those are going to be partial thread hex head cap screws, right? And then like we said, at those sizes, 10, 12, 14, and 22, that's where you're going to have some differences in the width across the flats. So depending on the application, you might need to specify to, to your supplier whether or not it is that you need a, a 933 or a 4017, right? Uh, now, outside of those sizes, you'll probably see that your supplier might even tell you that it is a DIN 933 slash ISO 4017, right? That's just because they are equivalent at that size. Okay, so uh, we're going to talk about this a little bit more next time um, as we dig into the fine thread hex head cap screws, you know, 960, 961. Uh, and, you know, the takeaway from this episode really is just that the M10, M12, M14, and the M22 are, the re are really the only sizes that you need to worry about there being a difference between the DIN and ISO uh, uh, um, equivalents for, for this part. Okay, um, guys, as always, you know, if feel free to contact me personally at London at EurolinkFSS.com um, with any questions and, of course, any RFQs, right? Also, I just want to do a little shout out today, Darkness to Light, for, our, for one of our philanthropic uh, groups, uh, Switch. Um, it is an uh, anti-sex trafficking group, uh, so just want to do a little shout out for them today. Um, have a great weekend.